Hey there. Welcome to my place. My name is Melissa L. Williams, and you might recognize me from Tyler Perry's Ruthless. I play Ruth. So today, I'm having someone you might not expect come over. Her name is Nadej August, and if you watch the show, she plays Joan, the creepy accountant. And if you don't watch the show, she still plays Joan, the creepy accountant. Our characters have sparked some sort of controversy because you got you guys love our characters together, and that's why since she lives... Girl, come on in. It's, the door is open. <sighs> All right. I got a red, a white, and a rosé. Oh, he's cute. So how's it going? Painful. I don't know why I bother to get waxed anymore. Uh, are we rolling? No, we're trolling ourselves. Oh, cute, cute. Hi. I'm Nadege August. So what are we doing? <laughs> we're, we're doing the show about Ruthless and how much everyone is missing oh. our beautiful faces on their television screen. Right, right. Oh, I love that so much. But first, any dating updates? Well, um, I've realized recently that I'm sapiosexual. Is this Melissa's coming out as a sapiosexual? Come on. Do you need a hug? Oh, better yet, do I need to be woke and say things like them, they, when I'm talking to you? You, girl, you should have been woke, okay? And, and I am. Now you're showing your foreignality. Oh, I see what you did there. Foreign and nationality. Sac passe. <laughs> okay, so let's say we get into these comments, because I put them in my notes. I really want people. Oh, you're such a I want to read it verbatim. Put it away. Okay, I'm going to bring us to the 21st century with oh. a Kyra. Oh. No, actually, it should go that way. Oh. Well, let's, let's get into do it. to be back on BET as well. And look, I promise it's closer than you think. And this one is from Moy Pone Wadadino. Oh, I look exotic, okay. okay. Uh, <laughs> Tyler Perry snapped when he made Ruthless on BET. I am obsessed. Who He's snapped? obsessed. Mm -hmm. And you know what? Thank you. I'll, I'll, we'll let him know when we go back on set and th that he snapped. That he I snapped he too. and that you're obsessed. Yeah. <laughs> We love it. I like that he's obsessed. I like that, that he likes that we I snapped. like any man who's obsessed. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Exactly. That's what the women want. Steffi Foeva says, this show, Ruthless, is off the chain. Yikes. I, I agree. Yeah, off all the chain. All we, the we resemble that comment, staff. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> off the charts, off the chain. Thank you. Thank you so much, Steph. Yeah. We do have a lot of fun doing it, though. Oh, absolutely. Oh, well, thank you. First of all, that one was from your DMs, right? Yeah, it's from Kev Serifila. Serifila. You should be like this. Okay, he's from France, and uh, I couldn't believe, how cool was that? That's really cool. To find out that like there's people in Europe watching our show. So wow. shout out to Kev. Um, and thank you. Yes, I am now a series regular. Most people don't know that because originally I wasn't supposed to be. So it worked out. Look at God. Yeah. Okay. So BT, get to France. <laughs> and rightfully so, because you're amazing as Joan on the oh, show. So I love you. Thanks, friend. The check is in the mail. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Shack530 says a good birthday gift would be some new episodes of Ruthless. Okay, well, we can't give you that episode right now. It's coming. But what we can do is sing happy birthday to you, Mr. Shack. Yes. Right now. Let's do it. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday, Mr. Shaq. Yes. That's to you and cheers. Ah. I hope you had a great birthday. Happy birthday. Okay, on this last one, I have to pull it from my phone because this girl literally wrote a text, a DM to Tyler Perry. You know those gifts you can act like you're texting right? people? So this is what her text or DM to Tyler Perry said. I'm gonna tell you something. If you don't release that MF episode of okay. Ruthless RN right now, I'm gonna become the highest 
and you're gonna be the first one on my list. Okay, <laughs> release that shit right now, or it's me and you. It was a little aggressive. <laughs> Just a bitch. <laughs> But, but she was committed, <laughs> she was committed in her aggression towards TP, by the way. Towards TP, we, we need him to be okay to write these episodes. So, oh, thank please. you for the passion, <laughs> but. But don't hurt him. Please. Yeah, don't do that. He no. will, those episodes are already written, trust me. The way he writes, mm. we'll get you those episodes, but just leave TP. Yes, Don't, please. don't send him those DMs. <laughs> yeah, don't become the highest. The highest is not nice. <laughs> Matt can handle that. Yes. <laughs> Let him be the highest. <laughs> Okay, so some common questions. I can think of one that I always get asked is, when are y'all gonna escape that cult? Oh. I have to get out. Well, the truth is though, if you think about it, I love cults. So I read up a lot about them. I love to hear about them. And people who are involved in them are so brainwashed. They don't know how to function outside of the cult. It's kind of like being part of a, a, a relationship, right? Ooh. Where you just don't know how to get out. You're co completely codependent. So there's that. Although I do feel like a nice little uprising against the highest might Ooh. might work. He deserves it a little yeah, bit. He needs a pushback. He needs a little pushback. You know, it's something like, know. I'm mad as hell and I'm not gonna take it anymore. And also look, I'm from Haiti. So there's that whole like a history of uprisings, right? Uh -huh. The first country to free from slavery and all that fun stuff. So I don't know, that's probably where my brain is going. But the fact is, it's a cult. You just don't get out, usually. You just don't get You don't out. get to get, get, get out. You get it? Anyway, did you know that she was from Haiti and now you do and that's foreignality. You guys get it, <gasps> comes full circle. Yeah. So yeah. One of the questions I get all the time and I bet you today, right now, there's a DM somewhere of someone saying, when is Ruthless coming in? Right. When is the next season? When? You know, I'm not gonna, <sighs> I get those questions all the time as well. I do have a little, little piece of information. You know, I don't get it. I, if I get in trouble, I, it's fine. I was told that. Oh, oh, I'm hearing this for the first time too. Go ahead. I was told that we come back in December. Sorry. I wish I was gonna say November, October. I think we're actually just gonna be airing the old episode, season three on BET during Thanksgiving. And then in December, you'll, you'll see- You'll be all caught up, so it'll be like a string. You know what, that's not a bad idea, right? Just have a marathon. Anyway, yeah. thank you guys so Expect, much. Are we gonna do this again? You come over. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can come over. And maybe I'll host once in a while. <laughs> okay, and yeah. and who, who else should we have over? Ooh, send us who you would like to see next on Restless in LA. That is the title of our after show for you guys. You should send us questions, comments, send us videos of yourself. Yeah. What do you think? You can imitate us if you want. We don't yeah. care. Oh, I know, I'd love that. A video, videos of yourselves, we would plug it into the show so you would see yourself within the show. Yeah, That'd come be, be a part of Restless Come be LA. restless with us. Send us DMs of your videos. You can send Twitter messages, whatever, but we'd love to see it. Thank you guys so much for supporting us. We, from the bottom of our hearts, changed our lives. We say love you. And thank you. Bye. Bye.